Hi, everybody. So today I have Norma back with us and she's going to talk about the endocrine system. And so I learned something a long time ago from a nurse who is my friend. And every 20, so if you put something on your skin, it's in your bloodstream in 26 seconds. So today we're going to talk about all the things that affect your endocrine system. Yes. Hi, yes. honey, and hi, hi. Everyone that's watching <laughs> us. Thank you for having me back. I am so excited to be here uh, with such a topic that is a passion of mine because it's things that I didn't know before. And once I started learning, my mind was blown. <laughs> so I wanted yeah. to just explain what the endocrine system is. So it regulates all biological processes in the body from conception to adulthood. It has five main functions, which are metabolism, growth and development, emotions and mood, fertility and sexual function, sleep and blood pressure. So basically everything, right? Yeah. <laughs> and when I started learning that everything we put in our skin goes right into our blood. Everything we put in our face from makeup, skin, I don't know, skin products, lotions, creams, everything doesn't stay on here. It goes deep inside. Yeah. So I started thinking, what does it matter if I spend 10, day, 10, 10 hours meditating a day if I'm not taking care of the inside as well, right? I'm taking care of my mm -hmm. brain, but I want everything to be flowing smoothly and, and everything to be in balance. Yeah. And a lot, of, a lot of us didn't know this, right? So my whole goal for this video, I want viewers, listeners to become curious about everything that they're putting into their skin, which is the largest organ that we have. Yeah. So what I do whenever I go to, I don't know, buy, de buy deodorants, right? Like when I switch to the clean beauty, mm -hmm. I, I spend so much time looking at the ingredients. If I don't know what a word is, I won't buy it because I want to make sure that I know everything that is going into my armpits, right? Yeah. Because it's going to go inside me. Right. So and it's I, a lymph node too. Exactly. So I can be eating super healthy and very, very rich foods, but what if I'm not taking care of, of here, right? Of outside. Mm -hmm. And I wanted to share today a quote that I read this morning, which I think it just, it blew my mind. And it says, artificial fragrances are the new secondhand smoke. That was said by Dr. Karina Dunlap. So it really blew my mind because, you know, I was the type that I wanted my home to smell beautiful all the time. And my mm -hmm. neighbors could smell it from outside. <laughs> like I would put in so many candles and those are all endocrine disruptors. Yeah. So I made the switch to essential oils and I, you know, have diffusers now. I just feel that everything needs to be together, right? We float together, mind, body, spirit. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> what do you use, honey? I want to, I want to ask you, what is your beauty routine? Uh... Well, I get all my stuff from the health food store. So, yeah, but you know, all my makeup, all my lotions and everything. And I do still read because you can still get something that's, you know, yes. natural, but exactly. it's not necessarily chemical free. Yes. So there are a few stores, right? Because we, now we have technology. We are always, mm -hmm. everything's available on our fingertips. So if I go to a store and I don't know what something is, I go on my phone and I become curious, right? I start searching, okay, what mm -hmm. is this? And, and now there are stores that, for example, there's one called Credo that I know there's all over, 
but mm -hmm. that's the only one that I know that has like everything is clean and they have a full list of ingredients that every product has. So if it's not listed there, they won't have it. Like everything needs to be there. I know that there's products that just say like and other ingredients. Mm -hmm. So I won't touch those because who knows what those other ingredients are. But I like transparency. So I like products that have very few that are more, even if it's made in small batches, I like yeah. that. Yeah. I like that it's, it doesn't have a very long shelf period. I like those things because that means it doesn't have you no know, preservatives, preserv like all these right. things. So that's what I wanted to, to share with everyone just to become curious. Right. Everything that they are putting in their bodies. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. So when I learned about the 26 second thing. Yes. Um, she said, go home and put a garlic clove between your toes and see how long it takes for you to taste it. So, wow. Yeah. So just experiment with things, you know, because your pores have no filter. Your stomach has, I mean, at least a little bit of a filter. It goes through your stomach so, yeah. and all that acid and everything, but there's no I filter feel, at all with your pores. Exactly. And I, I also feel that before, you know, we didn't have technology. We didn't have all these websites with all this information. So right now there's no excuse for us to not become responsible. Right. right? And, and we have to take responsibility about what we put into our bodies. There's even nail polishes that you know, don't have, I believe it's like the seven free, do you yeah. know the, the seven Yeah, free and eight? I've, I've gotten nail polish even from like Etsy that I've yeah. got ingredients. Yeah, mm -hmm. exactly. So there are things out there for us to make the change. Yeah. Right. But unfortunately, they're not big companies. Hopefully in the future, they will be big companies, but let's look for these small business yeah. let's look for these people that are wanting to make this world a healthier and better place mm -hmm. yeah and ultimately it does come down to responsibility like we have to take responsibility for everything now <clears throat> the world is changing and it's about to change more and more so you know taking responsibility for what you do every day is just huge at this point not just with this but with everything and be self-loving, love yourself. Yes, and yeah. have fun with it, right? right? I have I have so much fun trying different deodorants. Mm -hmm. I live in the city of, of San Francisco and I walk everywhere. So I know that if I'm gonna go out for, I don't know, a lunch and I'm not gonna come back until later night, I use a different deodorant, also natural, but I know it's a little bit heavier and I will be, you know, releasing so much as if I'm just going to be doing some exercise or if I go to a yoga class and it's not heavy stuff, I use a different one, also clean. But I do know that, you know, our bodies are meant to release. Yeah. So when we use deodorants that are not letting us release, we become blocked, right? Right. So and yeah. Release. Detox is huge. I've been yeah. on a massive detox lately. And if I was continuously putting in more chemicals, it wouldn't do any good. Exactly. Yeah. It'd be like you taking steps back, right? Mm -hmm. So we don't want that. We want to take steps forward because our yeah. bodies are a beautiful mechanism and they love us and our bodies are here for us. They're a gift from the heavens. So I just, I want to invite everyone to, to please think of honey and of me every time that you're about to pick up something from the drugstore or from any, or, or a candle, right? There's a multi-billion market out there for candles. Mm -hmm. Just figure out what it has. Yeah. And if whether it's, it's gonna, good for you or not. Yes. Yeah. So, so please think of us the next time mm -hmm. that all of you go and, and 
pick up some stuff from the stores. <laughs> That's yeah, nice. we, we want everybody to be as healthy as possible. Yes, so. exactly. Because like I said, like I said, I mentioned before, it's mind, body, and spirit. Mm -hmm. right? If we're taking care of our spirit, well, we got to take care of our body. So everything can be yeah. in harmony and in full balance. Mm -hmm. I agree completely. So do you have any final things that you want to say to everybody today, Norma? I just want to thank everyone for starting this journey. I, I started a few years back and I feel great. <laughs> so it does work. Yeah. And, you know, just take responsibility. There are a lot of things out there that may try to get us. But if we're responsible and we do the work and we do the research, we can push them away and find good things that are good for us. Right. They are out there. They are. Exactly. And you're worth it. Yes. We are worth it. Yes. We're worth it. So no one is going to take care of our health the way that we're going to take care of our health. Right? right. It's up to us to be healthy in the mind, body, and spirit. We cannot blame anyone for, oh, you're not taking care of my mental health, my body, my, no, it's us, right? I take care right. of my body, you take care of your body. Exactly. No victims here. We can do it. Yes. Exactly. <laughs> Thank you, Norma. Thank you. Thank you for giving me the space to just share. Oh, absolutely. Appreciate Love to it. have you back. Okay. Thank you. Bye, everybody.